21 and we are at it again. We are going somewhere and we're going to... Mornington. Mornington Peninsula. So we're gonna do another road trip for the New Year's and this time we are not going to be alone. We are going to be with Zan, which is a close friend of mine. And today, right now, we are going to the city to pick her up. And then from there, we're going straight to the... As I was saying, we're going after the city, we're going to the peninsula. I hope you enjoy this video. Hi, Zan! We're still in 2021. Yes, finally. Let's go! Happy New Year, everyone, and I hope that the first month of the year has been good to you. Yeah? Okay. Just checking in the voiceover AC. We'll be back in a minute. Just a short note this trip's unplanned. We'll just be driving and see wherever the wind takes us. So, yeah. Enjoy!
to the beach. Yay. Rosebud Beach. We were expecting a lot of rain today, but not. Sunny. Let's find some shade to put our Pasta to make tuna pesto for dinner later. After Chef Zan is trying to mince and dice some garlic and onion. This is our campsite. Those are our neighbors. Little cute spot over here. Celebrating 2021, hoping that this year will be better. But for me, honestly, I am not that indignant with 2020. I am not undermining the people that have suffered, that have went through unpleasant change, that had to put life-defining decisions and plans on hold, confined in a room or exposed to this life-threatening virus and probably at the verge of losing one's mind. All motivation is lost, felt alone, fighting an inside battle with yourself, lost an opportunity, lost a job, and lost a loved one. No, I do not discount all of that. In fact, I've gone through some of it. But maybe the good thing that 2020 has resulted in my life is that I am better seasoned, more perceptive, and more appreciative of what I have. Ultimately, I am more closer to God than I was before. To be honest, I've never been more immersed in the Bible until 2020 happened. Some people may not see how that would save someone's skin, but it did help me with my mental and emotional health. You know, when God told me to leave it to him and let him do the job easier said than done but yes i got really tired exasperated with all the financial legal mental and emotional burden that i was carrying i told god lord i quit 
You handle it from here. You said you promised that you will provide, that you will keep us away from harm, that no weapon shall be formed against us, that you will heal us, that you will bring us to the land of milk and honey. You said all that and I'm claiming it because I am your daughter and you promised. Quite frankly, <laughs> I was raging towards God, praying that time. But I was raging, claiming for his promise. I highly recommend for you, whoever's listening to me babble right now, to try it. Claim your heavenly rights from your heavenly father. Because he is more than willing to give and never shorthanded with his promises. All you have to do is pray and believe by faith. Okay, enough of that 2020, the year that shall be mentioned ever again, it is the past. So now let's grow more together this year. Yeah? Oh, chocolate factory. Na go kart. <laughs> Cape Wolom wo, wo Lamai. Catch a wave against the backdrop of ancient pink granite at Cape Wolamai, one of Victoria's most popular surfing beaches and bird spotting mecca. Philip Island Nature Park's Penguin Parade. Oh, oh. <laughs> Clip and climb! <laughs> Day two, we are going to Philip Island. Philip Island! Yes. Philip Bay Island. Philip Island. Changing. Are you guys excited? Yes. yes! But I fear that I might not reach the top. My arms are too weak. <laughs> okay. It's okay. It's okay. We'll try our best. I have very great safety net attached to the station, and it's very connected to one of these lines but what we call a lock and key system. Step long, step long. One eternity later. <laughs> Days later. I believe I can fly. At least one. Yes, Go, you can do it. You can! Pagawasang imong kwan, pagka ongoy. 
Kata si ikaw pangawat og mangga si silingan. Ah, dali ara po dali. down Taking this, it's for free. See, no scratch, not broken, not anything. Taking it home. <laughs> I'm currently editing this video and I just quickly want to show you the chair. Yes, that's the one that I got from the trash at Phillip Island. Such a beauty. Jeka or the Yal Yal Wun to Long Kun Rong Big.